This is Will's Front, brought to you by theunshackled.net. Moira took over from, uh, from Jeremy, who did a great job for the last couple of years, and Moira has taken over and just done a magnificent job since. And today's effort, and what a sensational crowd it is, what a huge crowd it is, today's effort is very much as a result of the work that Moira has done. So ladies and gentlemen, I would ask you to give a very, very warm welcome to the Secretary of March for the Babies, Moira Deeming. Thank you, Bernie. Well, when I was 16, believe it or not, I would have been over there with those guys. When I was 16, my best friend got pregnant and I helped her to get an abortion because I thought to be a good friend was to do exactly what they said they wanted. And that abortion destroyed my best friend and she couldn't even look at me afterwards because I reminded her of the most painful thing that had ever happened to her. Abortion is a lie. You are not loving women by getting them abortions. Thank you. Eleven years ago, I became a mother for the first time. And while I was enjoying my new baby, this parliament was debating legalising abortion until birth. And many brave men and women stood up against it. But none has come close to what Bernie Finn did and still does. When the law was being debated and due to be voted on, Bernie spoke against it for six hours. And as we know, shamefully, that bill was passed and no amendments got through with it. Since that day, there have been over 5,000 post-20 week abortions. Every single year in Victoria, an average of 35 babies are born alive after failed abortions and are left in a pan to die or are killed. We are not going to give up. We're not just gonna lay down and let that keep happening. And Bernie is not the type to give up. He's a fighter. And so 10 years ago, with a little band of rebels, he formed the March for the Babies. And he has led this march as president ever since. And when abortion is finally repealed and actually becomes unthinkable for us who have access to all kinds of birth control, we will have Bernie Finn to thank. So a big round of applause to Bernie Finn. So the 10th anniversary March for the Babies 2019 has just concluded. I'm with the new secretary of the March for the Babies, Moira Deming. Uh, this, is your, this is your first one. Uh, how did you feel it went? Uh, I think it went really well. The police did a fantastic job. We had great security. Um, it's just a fantastic team and everyone had a really good time. The choir was beautiful, it was a really great atmosphere, very happy and upbeat. Oh, the choir was amazing and yes, the, the, the men in black, uh, they, they did an excellent job and made sure not just that they kept the, the other mob at bay but also that we were safe as well. None of us tripped on the, the trams tracks because uh, we went the long way this year. Normally it's, it's yeah. up Spring Street but we, well, I suppose it's the 10th anniversary, we should march a bit we, longer for We made for it a bit special this time, we thought we'd go a bit, a bit all out, so yeah. And, well, they're all gone over there now but it was pretty... They, they tried to scream as loudly as possible, but it was a pretty uh, weak effort, I think. It was very amusing. They actually turned up at one o'clock and were really chanting as hard as they could. And I thought, I don't think they realised that nobody's getting here until two because we were doing a longer walk. So I think they tired themselves out early and it worked out well. <laughs> uh, so there were three uh, interruptions. Uh, it was just three young... Or you could tell that they were left, left, far left socialists or, or, or whatever. They, they, uh, they had a bit of a scream and they were gently uh, just removed by the, the men in black. Yeah, I mean they just had the usual chance, something about Hitler and Nazism or something completely irrelevant. So we mm. just ignored them and carried right on. Well, there was a, a National Socialist rally at uh, the same time today at Box Hill. Yeah. Uh, uh, so they were at the wrong event if they yeah, wanted exactly. to protest I think they that. Got confused. <laughs> or maybe it was just easier for them to, to pick on uh, women, children, families. Mm. Although I did see a feisty little old lady uh, rip the, the honking horn out of one girl's hand. She wasn't going to have it, and so that was amusing for me to see from the stage. <laughs> 
And of course, this today was, it was a message of, of love. Uh, everyone, because there was also a heckler on the way, everyone just responded. And, and when the, the interruptions happened, everyone was just silent. They, they got to have a say for, say, maybe 20 seconds before. So we were pretty accommodating, I think. Yeah, exactly. We just relaxed and waited until they were removed. No one panicked. It was good. Mm. Yeah. So I think for your first uh, March for the Babies, it was peaceful, the police did an excellent job, so did the, the Men in Black, amazing, touching speakers this yeah. year. And this is how a protest should be done. Yeah, mm. it was just beautiful. People who actually have experience with abortion, I know they bag out Bernie because he's a white male, but I could see mostly white males on that side of the fence anyway, and I thought it was beautiful that uh, our speakers spoke directly to them. I mean, as, as you heard me say, I would have been on that side of the barricades at one point in my life, and, you know, we don't judge them, we just we just try and persuade them and make our case. Well, that makes the, the Nazi accusation even more ridiculous. It was yeah. the Nazis who promoted abortion and euthanasia and killing of the vulnerable. Just and dehumanisation in general. And this was pretty much a representation of multicultural Australia. There were Asians, yeah. Pacific Islanders, very pro-life uh, communities. They were, they were some of the most vocal I oh, saw. Absolutely. Yeah, they're so passionate. We're, our biggest church presence is always from the ethnic churches. Absolutely. They're very passionate about it. They, they held no excuses, nothing. They're very, very uh, clear cut on that issue. And on the way, because you were taking care of things here, there was on one irate uh, driver who uh, was upset that he got held up and uh, swore an obscenity. But the thing is, we were through there five minutes yeah. and that's it. Like, unlike the Extinction Rebellion people this week, there were three or four hours because well, they super glued themselves or used whatever yeah. thing. So right. five minutes in traffic just to hear a pro-life message, I think that's right. <laughs> once a year. Yeah, and we planned and booked the police resources. Yes. Once a year, done. Was fully advertised, yep. everyone was warned. That's right, exactly. Yeah. Well, congratulations oh, on your, you. your first uh, march. Well done. Thank and you so you'll continue yeah. to be politically active because you're, you're first known as one of the mama warriors against safe schools, but yes. there's way more to you than that. Oh, yeah, I'm finding all sorts of ways I can get involved now. It's very good. Mm. <laughs> and raising your three children? Four children. Four children. It's, it's been another one. <laughs> one another one. Well, that's good. Yeah, we've got a one-year-old. Yeah, no, it's great. Yeah, I think being a mother is the best thing that ever happened to me, you know. And as I said, I used to be a left-wing feminist. I used to think motherhood would be terrible. And it's the best thing that ever happened to me. I, I well, can't maybe, believe the message. Maybe there's hope for those people over I there. Hope so. Well, congratulations again, and I'm sure 2020 and well every March in the in the coming year in the lead up to 2022 is going to be important when the next yeah. state election is due. Yeah. We're fully focused. We're going to get more and more people every year. It's going yeah. to become a massive campaign now. I'll let you get back to other people congratulating you. Okay. Thank, Thank you, you so much. much. Thanks for coming. This is Will's Front, brought to you by theunshackled.net.